previous owner, I guess, set this motor in here and a couple of things on it. I mean, you know, it has sand all over everything. I pulled the oil tank out to reclean it and uh, they forgot to put, uh, I don't know why, but they took this stud out of the cylinder head here and there's no way to get one back in there. And since I got the oil tank out, I take all the motor mount bolts off, take the top one, take the fronts off, take all the bolts out of the back. Now, uh, all I got to do is jiggle the motor forward and tilt it to the left a little bit to be able to get the stud in there. And put a little lock, put a little red Loctite on the stud when you put it in there. All right, let's see if we can get this in there before the damn rain starts. It's supposed to be scattered thunderstorms today. But... Kind of wedged in there right now. Makes you almost wonder how much sand is in this motor. Well, I guess we'll find out here. Well, good thing is that everything taped off on here as far as the uh, exhaust and intake and oil lines and oil pump and all that. Yeah, that, that's fairly decent, but still. Second to dry. It's a lot better. And then another dab of Loctite on there. Everything should be cleaned out. Looks like it might be a little too long. Remember, it has to be short enough to. Clear the frame here to actually get the nut on there. Now, obviously, if you're using the Harley port number, you don't have to do this as far as cutting the stud the length. Okay, so I'm just going to leave that on there and cut it off with the cutoff here right there. And then I'll run a die down it just to chase the threads. Sticking the motor back in and tightening everything back up. Cleaning out the oil tank tonight, too. That thing's got sand in it as well. Other thing, if you're using stainless bolts on stuff, be sure to put never seize on them. They put stainless bolts in the top rear mount, the top two bolts on the rear mount without putting never seize on them, and they're already galled together. So I'll be putting the stock bolts back in there because I got those. Uh, if you like my content, please like, share, subscribe, comment, all that jazz, and uh, and maybe I can ride at some before Myrtle Beach. I got to fix his other bike there because when you go to take your driver's test, they get kind of picky on exhaust systems and turn signals and all that crap. It's like it has to pass the state inspection to be able to ride it. Because it's the state police giving the driver's test anyway. So, need to get that crap ready. One, one or the, This one or the other bike. One or the other. I think he wants to ride the other bike.
the green, green and purple bike salvage. But he'll ride whatever. They're, they're, they're basically the same bikes. Not basically, they are the same bikes. And well, I think his test is on the 28, 27, 28, somewhere in there. Anyway, guys, take care. Have a good weekend. Happy Easter.